my dear friends welcome to my youtube channel i thank you for your continuous support by watching my videos and making constructive comments in the comment box hope everyone is keeping good health and maintaining the covid protocol as you all know that availability of nutritional food mainly for the rural women and children should be an important mission for all of us the water available in different types of water bodies like rivers, reservoirs, lakes, ponds, etc. are being already utilized for fish farming throughout the country and fisheries is contributing substantially towards nutritional security of the people. Today I am going to discuss about a new type of water body which are available in very large numbers in the rural areas of the country but so far they have not been utilized for fish farming. These are irrigation wells which have been constructed by the farmers themselves as well as under many central and state government schemes like Million Well Scheme and Mahatma Gandhi Rural Employment Act to name a few. The water of these wells are not used for drinking but for irrigation of the rice, wheat and vegetable fields so the water available in them can very well be utilized for fish farming. So for fish farming in the wells, there are four stages. These are one, selection of the well, second is seed stocking, third is feeding and fourth is harvesting. Now how to select irrigation well for fish farming? Selection of irrigation well is a very important and for which some of the following points should be kept in mind. These are number one, water of the well should not be used for drinking purpose. For this you have to inquire from the villagers that the water is not used for drinking purpose for the human beings but are used only for the irrigation. Second is the well should hold at least 10 feet of water throughout the year otherwise it will be difficult for the fish to survive. Third is if there is a wall around the well, if the well is quite protected it will be better because snakes etc enter into the open wells and eat the fish seed you will stock. Then there should not be any catfish already present in the well, otherwise they will eat the fish seed you will stock. And the last one is the well should not be very far from the house of the farmer because if he or she will have to visit uh, the well daily, they will just uh, leave it and so the feeding of the fishes will stop and they will die. So if it is nearer their house, it is better. So once selected, a small quantity of lime can be spread in the well for controlling the pH of water. After the well is selected and lime is uh, used, you can use uh, pangas fish seed uh, which have been found suitable in an experiment in Jharkhand state and pangas has grown also very fast and has been uh, quite compatible in uh, well culture. So, seed of pangas can be kept in a bucket in one or two or three uh, phases. You can stock them slowly. Uh, take the seed in the bucket water and pour it in the, slowly let it go down and let it swim outside the bucket. So, this way you can stock the seed, not that you, uh, you throw the seed from outside. Now, how many number of seed? In a smaller wells, 100 pieces and in larger wells, 250 to 250 to 300 pieces can be stocked. You can start with this number and later on you can adjust as per your own experience. Then comes feeding. Feeding the fishes is very important. They should be fed twice daily with factory formulated floating feed, initially with a smaller size pellets like 2 millimeter and with high protein content and later on with large size pellets of 4 millimeter size and less protein content. Every month some amount of lime can, lime can be added in the well water so that uh, pH is maintained and the decomposition of excreta deposited on the floor is also done. After 9 to 10 months, fishes of suitable size can be harvested using a cast net. Imagine if this type of fish culture is adopted in the rural areas of the country, how much additional fish can be produced. So if you are going to start fish culture in irrigation well, 
I will request you to please mention in the comment box so that other viewers can also get motivated. If you have any query regarding this culture system, you can ask by writing in the comment box. I will try to answer them. Please like the video and subscribe my channel. Thank you very much for watching my video.